But Thank we're going to start with our top story mm -hmm. this morning, that dramatic twist in the Matthew Perry investigation. U.S. Attorney Martin Estrada talking to the media, providing explosive developments here. Following Mr. Perry's death in October of last year, law enforcement, my office, and our partners represented on this stage began an in-depth, wide-ranging investigation. That investigation has revealed a broad, underground criminal network responsible for distributing large quantities of ketamine to Mr. Perry and others. This network included a live-in assistant, various go-betweens, two medical doctors, and a major source of drug supply known as, quote, the ketamine queen. We charged five defendants in this matter. These defendants took advantage of Mr. Perry's addiction issues to enrich themselves. They knew what they were doing was wrong. They knew what they were doing was risking great danger to Mr. Perry, but they did it anyways. In the end, these defendants were more interested in profiting off Mr. Perry than caring for his well-being. Joining us now is federal defense attorney Ronald Chapman. 